Something sparks from Durango's narrow gauge railroad are what started the devastating 416 fire. Now the La Plata County Sheriff's Office is saying a vandal tried to get even with that train's owner. News 13's Brittany Bade has the story. Durango's 416 fire has destroyed more than 54,000 acres. This is an event that's going to be a part of our community for a long time to come. And now the La Plata County Sheriff's Office is telling the Durango Herald it, quote, makes sense. A vandal fueled by the fire tried to damage the home of Durango and Silverton Narrow Gauge Railroad's owner, Al Harper. It said expletive the train. Uh, was written in permanent marker. But the vandal actually hit Harper's neighbor. There were some overturned plants, some overturned lawn furniture uh, as well. The official cause of the 416 fire is still under investigation. But a man first on the scene says he often sees sparks from the train start fires, and many believe in this case the train is to blame. It had already gone up so far that my hose wouldn't get it. My hose is about a hundred foot spray. Though the sheriff's office spoke to the Herald about the vandal's motive, they refused to talk to News 13, instead pointing us to La Plata County, who does not agree with the sheriff's office. Without suspects identified, let alone in custody or having been interviewed, I, I think it's inappropriate to speculate on motive. With the fire still burning, Harper's neighbor is worried they could get hit again. They're concerned about their home security and, and certainly don't want to be targeted again. Brittany Bade, KRQE News 13. Harper declined to comment. The sheriff's office does not have any suspects at this time.